Please forgive me I'm a stranger in this land I have nothing in my hands I don't need to be so shy Just a traveler Well, here we are, and look, there's Allapool in the Northwest Highlands of Scotland, home of the Loch Broom FM medicine show. There's, there's the ferry over to Lewis. That is indeed Loch Broom F. Loch Broom. And a bit later on, I should be doing my radio show. And we'll have a concert after it with a very special guest sat here right with me, look at you. <laughs> this is Jeanette Gerry, oh. and you can be any further away from home I if you possibly, possibly try, no. could you? That's absolutely true. You come from a mountainous region though in Australia, don't you yourself? I do. Yeah. Down in all ages, it's cold. Yeah. Anything like this in any way at all? We have a lot of trees and a lot of tree ferns. Right. We don't have so much snow as you. Yeah, so that's... Nor do we have water. Yeah. So, with all other respects, yes, it's exactly yeah. the same. <laughs> so, you're uh, starting a European tour right now? Well, I am. Yeah. Yesterday, and I'll look in uh, Strath That's right, that was my first year. Yeah, that was beautiful as well, I have to say. It's a beautiful show. Well, thank you. It's a real pleasure to start my tour in such fine company. Yeah, and uh, here we are in Alipool now. Is this a place you've heard of before? You must have a romantic impression of the Highlands itself. I have to say that on the drive from Dingwall to Alcool, every picture I've ever seen of the Highlands is true. Yeah. Crystal streets, brilliant skies, yeah. glorious mountains, it's all true. I think you're lying about the weather. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, it's, I'm in short sleeves, but I'm bearing up under the cold. It's bright and sunny, but still, well, you can still feel the wind there, isn't it? Well, being a big Jesse from Australia, I've got <laughs> 7,000 layers on, I could do with another three. It's beautiful sunny skies. Yeah. Yeah. Please forgive me. I'm a stranger in this land. I have nothing in my hands. I don't need to be so shy. Here we are on Loch Broom FM on the Medicine Show, my special guest, uh, Jeanette Gerry, uh, who you just heard uh, from her album The Bastard's Daughter. Was uh, uh, your, your music is an eclectic mix, eh, that's fair to say, of uh, different strands of uh, Mary Duff uh, connecting with uh, Amy Lou Harris with a sprinkling of Joni Mitchell. Uh, all, uh, would there be three people that you could see as... Um, As influences? I'm very honoured by any or all of them. Oh, they're just fantastic singers. They're, they are, All yeah. of those guys. And, and some... But there's a bit of Led Zeppelin and a bit of... <laughs> there's a bit rock... Bad company. In there's a rock there's chicken there as well. Oh, there's a rock chicken Yeah, there. yeah. Uh, all the instruments on that song that we just heard, that they're uh, been mainly by you, so you're an instrumentalist as well as a singer-songwriter. Oh, I appear to have become one. Yeah. But, um, Is that a necessity? Oh, bloody-mindedness, I'd say. Good, yeah, <laughs> good. Yeah, yeah. And uh, uh, as far as the, the process of writing a song is concerned, are you writing songs in your head all the time? Or is that something that you... It's a discipline that you have to sit down and do? Um, it's a difficult question, really. The short answer is probably... The reality is uh, often, uh, the actuality is I'm either writing a song in my head or wanting to. Yeah. So it's uh, a perverse and chronic condition. <laughs> <laughs> and it never, it never stops either. It, it never stops. Yeah. Uh, even when there's nothing apparently there, when there's no you know, threads of songs starting, there's, there's an itch somewhere. Yeah. And, and so. where do you think you can track to this? This Where condition. do I think came down with yeah. the affliction? Yeah. Oh, I couldn't really tell you, to be honest. I've got no idea. Back in the, as a child? Can Certainly you remember? as a child, yeah. yeah. 
I think I was just drawn from a very early age. I loved words and I loved rhythms and mm -hmm. patterns and music just completely saturated me. Mm -hmm. uh, my earliest memory, in fact, is being somewhere about three years old and I, I can remember getting out of my grown-up bed uh, but my feet didn't reach the ground, you know. Yeah. Yeah. So I must have been very wee yeah. and thinking I'm going to be a singer. And I spent the, the next X years trying to figure out how you do that. Yeah. And I feel very grateful that I've, I've had a life of songs. Yeah. They're great. They're amazing vehicles, songs, aren't they? I mean, they just travel the world and they, they go through the ages, the they time travellers as well. They do. They, yeah. they connect us all. They remind us that we're all doing the best we can, putting one foot in front of the other, and we all feel all the same kinds of things. They Emotion. give us a new perspective on something. We all got the same emotions at the, the heart of it. I suppose that's that's uh, the heart of songwriting as well, really. Getting, getting to grip with that. Right. They link us all one yeah. way or the other. Yeah. And they, they carry you half the way around the world too. Well, they do. I'm 12,000 miles here on the strength of you know, songs, yeah. mine and, and other people's. It's, it's a, yeah. I still shake my head. My arm is bruised actually from pinching myself thinking that uh, I'm really doing this. It's a solid wonder and it's, it is a solid wonder to have you here as well. Uh, we should mention where, just in case people can't get out tonight, you should, you should make every possible effort to get out tonight. And I Dust do. off the helicopter, come on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, if you're in town there's no excuse. Get yourselves down to the Argyle Hotel. We'll be uh, kicking off with uh, the girls Fran and Sot and Lemon are going to be singing tonight, which is something uh, the three sisters don't get together that often. Uh, Lemon's not, doesn't live locally and they sing beautifully. So they're going to be singing uh, to get us started and uh, Jeanette will be on. Uh, well, she could fly high, only to tread at the sound of the But if you can, uh, your music, where, where's the best way? There'll be a MySpace, of course. Absolutely, you can go and visit me on MySpace and please be a friend. Yeah. If you do come onto the MySpace page, yeah. let me know uh, where you're from and who you are, and I'll yeah. be delighted to make friends with you and I'll reply as soon as I can. Yeah, it's not that easy on the road, but uh, you'll be. I, I won't indeed be able to reply straight away. Yeah. I'll have to wait till I get back to Melbourne, so yeah. be and, patient with me. And uh, all the dates are there. If, uh, if when you do come down, you can check them out for other places. You're coming back to Scotland a bit later on to do Edinburgh and Melrose. I, I am at Ed, Ed, I was going to say Ed, Elrose, Edinburgh yeah. and Melrose. There we go. Uh, at the end of the week. Yeah, and then uh, uh, over to Ireland and uh, Holland and Germany lining up now as well. So I'm I, I've got uh, the south of. Well, I'm heading south down into England. I'll be in the Traveller's Rest. Hi to Kevin. Yeah. You may or may not be up to hear me, but there you go. <laughs> um, certainly that's certainly in Derby. Uh -huh. And I'm down to Kent, and then yeah. I'm to London. Nice festival in Kent as well, I know this. Chimney Sweep Festival. Yeah. yeah. What a wonderful thing to be part of. Chim Chimney. Chim Chim Taru. <laughs> right, and then a quick dash to Dusseldorf. Right. Correct. Leisner Bar, I believe, if I'm saying it properly. Yeah. Well, have a great time. Thank you. I and it's indeed. a delight to be to have you with us. Uh, finally, in the medicine show, after talking about it for so long, uh, and I'm really looking forward to this evening. We'll play a couple of tracks.
Thank you.